Okay, before we even get started, where did you get the part about Lonely Hermit? I mean, butthurt I can understand. I've acted rather butthurt as of late, but Lonely Hermit? I mean, if you would use something like, uh, butthurt pedo ginger, then yeah, I guess I would have worked. But where did you get the part about Lonely Hermit? Hello, everyone. This is Chaotic Renegade speaking. I'm doing a commentary on GNR in 9-11, blah, blah, blah. Dude, turn your freaking mic up, I can barely hear you, and also, how much effort does it actually take to say GNR and SDP 911? Not a lot, I would imagine. He's, he's the kind of guy who is completely butthurt over tubers and dark ones' opinions, but he takes to other people's opinions. I took other people's opinions because they weren't angry, bitchy, or whiny comments seemingly complaining about the intro more than anything else, as opposed to comments by people like Zekul and Steven to Master, who uh, made very level-headed comments. Tubers and Dark One, on the other hand, just, decide, just decided to be angry and bitchy with me and complain about the intro more than anything else. So that's why I... It may seem that I'm rejecting their opinions or anything like that. For support was really stupid. He's a complete hypocrite to himself. He bashes other people, but it takes those people's opinions. So let's just get this over with, alright? Hey everybody, it's me. Sketch of Sketch TV. Man, it's just a different setting because I'm not sitting on the side of my bed now, but... Um... This is a public service that's set out to the Sketch TV fan base. You have no fan base. You have 37 subscribers. You've been two years on YouTube. And what you got? Really any people supporting with your videos. Well, you suck. Right. I suck because I'm one of the people of the opinion that you don't need, like, hundreds of subscribers to have a fan base. That you only need, like, 30-something. Right, that auto having my own opinion automatically means I suck. First of all, I am pleased, very, very pleased, to announce that Sketch TV has just reached its two-year anniversary. This guy is lonely inside. Dude, what part about being happy that Sketch TV has made it to its two-year anniversary makes me lonely inside? Where, where are you getting that? He has no freaking fan base. In your opinion, of course. That's right, what started as a dream back in 2008, with no real intention of becoming famous, has actually become a... How are you supposed to be famous? You know you have a hundred subscribers yet. You don't even have a partnership yet. I don't need to have a partnership to be famous on YouTube. I mean, there's plenty of other people who never got partnerships that are very famous on YouTube. There's Big Al, uh, Random DC, Boomstick545, or hell, even TN Pan. So I don't need a partnership to be famous, and I like to think of at least a cult success. I've earned like 30-something subscribers. I figure that's a feat in itself. Why are you still so celebrating yet? I think you should be start celebrating when you have a higher subscribers for a tribute with your videos. God, you're an idiot! You're calling me an idiot because I have my own way of doing things and that way of doing things isn't like yours? Look who's doing the opinion bashing now! I'd like to thank each and every one of my subscribers for their support, and I would like to thank my future subscribers. Subscribers are... I sound like an idiot at this point. You don't have any friends. Nobody likes you. Actually, there are plenty of people who like me, plenty of people who are my friends, so that automatically makes your argument completely flawed. And I want to th send out a special, very, very special thanks to my man, my boy, my pal, mi amigo, Josh. Hodgson, at YouTube, at username Hodgson3172. He's one of my friends and one of my subscribers, my first subscriber, in fact. So I'd like to give a special shout-out to him, and if you like... You don't have any friends. Nobody likes you. That wasn't even funny the first time. Why use it a second time? So 
worry about that. This is a bull. I'm getting to the bullshit now. I'm just having some shits and giggles time with this fake public service now. So let's move on. My commentaries: The Dark One, Seven O Seven, Tubers Ninety Three. Now, I'm going to be one of the first to admit that I'm about to make some pretty stupid moves here. You both are total morons. Yeah, you guys, you are morons. Because I blocked you and you can't stand up to me now because you are stupid. Because you are stupid. And last but least, you are stupid. Now, see, you lost your point when you were like, <laughs> That just puts you on the wrong side of immature, in my opinion. Wow. You didn't really pwn them that well. But I pwned them. Is that what you're saying? You All you have done thus far is call me names and not even back up your opinions. And you know what? This goes out to you, Dark1707, and to you, Tubers93. I give you this. Again, I'm going to be the first to admit that that was probably one of the worst moves I could have possibly made in that video. I'm so cool, I gave tubers and dark one to me the finger. Because I blocked you too. I rule. Even if I'm a complete pussy or a cunt, I rule. Again, you lose your point with quite a few people when you go, or something like that. Put that in your pot and smoke it. Now, granted, there have been some commentaries down on me that I actually found were rather level-headed, rather, rather good. First one is by Steven Tamaster, who I'm sure is watching this video right now, as he is one of my subscribers. Hey, news flash for ya. Steven Master supports tubers. Even I support Steven Master. Did you know that? No? Well, people who subscribe people, some people do subscribe people are terrible, even my new commentaries on them. And really all they're doing is just bringing him closer to a partnership, if you ask me. 